Cases of sexually transmitted diseases are on the rise everywhere. Yeah, and health experts say there are no signs of slowdown. Mm -hmm. This is Sexual Health Week, and so we're taking this opportunity to speak with our intimacy expert, Dr. Viviana Coles from Houston Relationship Therapy. Good morning. Good morning. All right, you're here to talk about safe sex, even mm -hmm. if a partner is unwilling. Well, and even just the word safe sex, we like to use the word safer sex practices because truly, Anything can happen, uh, depending on where it is that you're coming from with all of this. So, yeah, I think it's super important to talk about safer sex practices with every partner that you'll ever have. Mm. It can be an awkward conversation, sure. especially if you're with a new partner. Mm -hmm. Where do you begin with that, and how do you have it where everybody gets on the right same yeah. page? Again, I, I think the most important part of it is to say that it's promoting better connection, more pleasure, long-lasting health benefits to be on the same page when it comes to safer sex practices. And of course, condoms are not 100%, but they're an easy way, especially for new partners, to be able to experience lots of different fun um, without having to do something that's more long-term. So how can you make this conversation a little less cringy? It's not something you would want to necessarily bring up in the moment. Do you bring it up you know, beforehand. beforehand. Absolutely. You want to talk about these things beforehand. If you aren't able to discuss it, then you need to be ready. Mm -hmm. So either one of you, whoever is going to be included in this is going to need to be ready. Um, also think about the what ifs. Okay, so what if they say this? What if they say that? What if they say condoms are too uncomfortable? I don't like to wear them. Well, having unsafe sex is uncomfortable for me and I won't be able to. So having some definitive answers to some of the most common things, mm -hmm. um, even if somebody says, I don't know how to put one on. Okay, practice. Mm -hmm. Practice at home. You need to be as the owner of your body and as somebody who wants to participate. And done this conversation mm -hmm. need to even happen with older people like grandparents because Absolutely. I've done stories mm -hmm. where grandparents are, are running rampant with sexually transmitted mm -hmm. diseases because they thought, well, I couldn't get pregnant, so I didn't think to use protection. 100%, absolutely. And actually, STIs and STDs are in that population through the roof. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what's the goal and what's the main takeaway you want people to, to get from this conversation during Sexual Health Week? It's more than just about contraceptives. Oh, well, absolutely. Be intentional about what you're doing. Make sure that you're not just doing one thing and thinking about things on the fly that are going to impact you and possibly your partner forever. So well thought and take care of yourself. Dr. Mm -hmm. V, so helpful. Thank you for that. Yeah. Good aware.